What's up, everyone? I am GTA King, as always. This is another GTA 5 video. This is for Xbox Series X and S and PlayStation 5 for Grand Theft Auto Online Expanded and Enhanced. This is an updated version on the car to car merge. The follower requirements are going to be needed for the person that is merging is a donor car and the LS car meet. A car meet membership need to be rep level one, need to be a rep level 20 or higher in the car meet, and you would need at least 1k that's one thousand dollars so you can start a takeover. Or you would also need to own a galaxy super yacht or a Kasaka with a sparrow in it, or you can own a buzzer inside of your CEO. For the helper that is helping, they will also need to be in the car meet with any car, does not matter what car. And they will also need to be level 20 or higher in the car meet. And they will need to just follow along with all the steps. It's pretty easy. They have perhaps nothing to do. But let's get right on to it. But as first, as always, make sure you smash that like button, subscribe to my channel, turn on post notifications, and let's get it. Let's go. go. So we got our donor car in here. Our donor car is the car we're taking the mods from. We already own the car that we are going to put the mods onto inside of our auto shop. That can be in any garage. Just know where it's at when you're ready to call it out. For a person that's merging, you're going to go to your interactions menu, go to LS Car Meet, and you'll send them a sprint. But before you do that, you're going to want to register as an MC president. We're going to register as an MC, and we're going to send on that sprint invite. Then we're going to accept that sprint, and we're going to pull up our interactions menu, go to Motorcycle Club, and we're going to kick them out of our car by returning them. I return it to storage at two seconds before the sprint starts. Don't forget you will need someone inside a different targeting mode to bounce off of. And there is a way to do this back to back without restarting your game and I'll explain that later on in the video. So at two seconds you're going to return your car to storage. That's going to put your friend on an infinite black screen with a infinite loading. So what you're going to do is go to interactions menu and request your car back in the car meet. You will be in the car meet with no mini map just like this. Once your car is back in the car meet, you can go start a takeover. This is where that thousand dollars come into play. Once you're in that sprint and that three, two, one, go goes off of your screen, either you or your friend can end the sprint race. It doesn't matter who. I'll go ahead and end it. And there's a two ways you can do that. You can either start the job to the pause menu and then back out, or you can join Anawak and accept all the alerts. I use Anawak XS for new gen because he is in a different targeting mode. He is in free aim. And he is in a bad sport lobby. And you just going to accept all the alerts. And it will bring you back down. In the same lobby as your friend. From here you're just going to make your way. Into the car meet. And you're going to go into the regular car meet. Where the AI cars are at. You are not going to go in your takeover. And the same thing with your friend. He is not going to join his takeover. Or yours. So you're just going to go right on in the car meet. Once you're in the car meet, you can go ahead and disband your MC, the one that is merging, and your friend is going to want to register as an MC. Now, depending on what you're going to use for or the merge, rather, you're going to be using the Sparrow 
or if you're gonna use your buzzer, you will have to go ahead and register as a CEO if you're gonna use the CEO buzzard before you get outside. You would need to register at this time as a CEO, but we're gonna use that sparrow from the Kasaka. So we're gonna make our way over to our friend's car and we're gonna hop on it. So he's gonna to wanna to make sure his car is set on everyone. Once we are in it, he is going to send us a sprint invite because we have a cooldown. Down. And if doesn't, and honestly, it does not matter who starts the sprint, but we had him send it because we start the first one. So we do have that cooldown. From here, he's going to pull up his interactions menu, go to Motorcycle Club, and he's going to return his car at two seconds using that Motorcycle Club. So we're just chilling like a villain inside of his car. I want to go ahead and mention at this time I am working on a brand new Discord server for y'all to join. It'll be for Xbox and PlayStation. I'll be posting the link pretty soon, so stay tuned for that. Now that you're on your black, your solid black screen, you're just going to go to that friend inside a different targeting mode, and you are going to join him, and you're going to accept the first and decline the second. Your friend's just chilling in the car meet with no car in there right now. So we're just going to pause menu once we're outside. Go to this online, options, and we're going to kill ourselves. At this time, our friend can use that interactions menu in his game to go ahead and request his car back in the car meet. But he wants to wait until we tell him that we're in the sparrow or a buzzard. Or if he wants to, he can look at the pause menu. He can put pause and switch his camera outside. When he sees that we're in a, in a buzzard or a sparrow, then he's good to start a takeover. Be careful because cars will hit you just like that. Because the AIs in this game, they are the worst drivers ever. So we're just going to find our sparrow. And hop right on in it. And at this time, our friend can go ahead and start up our that takeover once his car is inside the car meet. Now, keep in mind that first part we did was the glitch out method. So the part that you see in right now, where our friend gets us out of the car, if you want to merge another car. You would just stay inside the game and your friend's going to restart his game once you merge your car. So you can come back and you can merge again because as long as you are staying in the lobby and you do not leave this session or you do not restart your game, you are still glitched out so you can merge again. But make sure you save your car before you your next merge so we're gonna make our way over to where our galaxy super yacht is and while we're doing that we're gonna go ahead and call our yacht captain to get him on the phone our friends just gonna be driving around right now in this car while we're in the sprint race Yes, keep in mind once the sprint race is over, while your friends restart your game for you to merge again, you need to save your car by changing something on it. Or you can call out the MLC with personal vehicle storage in Bay 3, and you can drive it right in the back of the MLC, and it will automatically save. So you have to get as low as you can to your yacht if you're too high in the air. 
or you can request that personal vehicle. And we're just gonna wait for it to spawn in on the map. And we're gonna hold Y to respawn. Now that our car is merged, there's a couple ways we can end the sprint. Your friend can just leave the lobby, or you can join Anavac and accept all the alerts. So we're gonna go ahead and do that, or you can start up a job and back out of it. But if you want to merge again, you would stay in this lobby. Your friend will restart his game, and then he'll join you back. And you'll start up from the process of where he kicks you out of his car. He does not have to get inside your car because you are already glitched out. So to save this, all we got to do is call out our MOC. And drive in there and it automatically saves. Or you can take any mod shop on it and change one thing on it to save it. But if y'all did find this video helpful, go ahead and smash that like button, subscribe to my channel, and turn on post notifications. And make sure you follow me on social media for all the latest glitches and all the latest information and in GTA as all things come out and updates. And I will catch you guys inside the next video. And just like that, we are gone, and I hope y'all have a great night and or day.